Okay, so today we're going to make a little dragonfly. Thank you, Deborah and Rob, for the camera. And this will be because Daniel wanted to know how to make this for his class. Oh, we have a little guest. Oh, that was beautiful, if you saw it. Little tiny hopper. And so we're going to do a little dragonfly. So here's the basic tools I used today. A little pair of wire cutters. A flat needle nose with no teeth and a round needle nose called a mandrel needle nose. So these are the three basic tools I use today. And I have a little bit of sandpaper, maybe a three to four hundred, three to four hundred grit, and maybe about a five to six hundred grit. Okay, and so I have some recycled wire. This is from a, some wire, uh, yeast wire. And so I took one off, and so I'll run my hand down it real gently to make sure there's no burrs. Okay, once I know there's no little sharp edges, I take this like this and I hold this and I take the uh, 3 to 400 grit and be careful your eyes and anybody else's so wear protection if you need to on your eyes and so I take this and I pinch this kind of tight and I gently pull see and I do this two three times maybe even a few more okay and that makes the wire really shiny and straight and then maybe I'll take the 5 to 600 grit and I'll do the same thing one more, a couple more times, even give it a more polished shine. And I'll put those aside, and I'll just kind of straighten the end a little bit. Straighten the end a little bit, make sure it's kind of straight. Okay, so there's our wire. We'll put the dragonfly over here. Boink. Okay, so this should be about five minutes. Okay, and so, first, I take these. And for the length of the body, maybe I want that about, oh, a couple fingers. And so I take that and I bend that like this. That makes the little body, okay? Now, once I have that, I take this and right so it just folds right at the top and I go this way. And these are the wings, that's the body. And here's another wing, or here's a wing. And I kind of fold that up this way, okay? So there's one wing. Now on the other side, about the same distance for the wing, I fold this this way. And now there's two wings basically. I come back over to this side. I put that right about here sometimes. And I just about the same size. One more time right here. And there's the third wing. And then come over to the last one. I do this right here that and I push that up like that and there's the fourth wing okay we have two wings four wings excuse me <laughs> and the body and so now maybe I'll hold this kind of where I want it and I'll take this piece that's left over and I'll go around this right there, I kind of pinch those a little bit and I'll go around those right there those two wings and around these two wings and I'll come back up here like this. And once I have it like that, I come around the body a little bit, just to light pinch it. So once it looks kind of like this, I'll get a little bead. Here's a little bead. And I'll take the bead. Whoops. Let's not lose our bead. And we'll do this. And we'll put a little bead on there so you can see it. And I'll just kind of hold the bead in, in place as I bring the wire around and then I'll do that a couple times around the body just kind of hold that up in there and usually I cut that off but let's take that and do this tighter and do this Let's see. we'll bring this to the bottom side here in fact sometimes if you ever notice a dragonfly they have those little things so why don't we just leave it just like that that looks really beautiful I've never done that before and so here's our bead here's our wings so when you have your wings like this I kind of line them up so that they're together. 
See, and I push something through it gently, just a little bit to open it up. Same thing on the other side. Push something right through here, line them up, and I push that through to open them up just a little bit. And once you have that, I could take and close the whole plier, and I could put that in there like that. Then you can just kind of move it around a little bit and straighten out your wing a little bit. Same thing on the other side. Straighten it out a little bit. Straighten out the body a little bit. Okay, we have it like that. And now maybe we'll do something like this. And there's a little dragonfly. And so I'll set that right there so you can see it and I'll move these out of the way. And you can bring more shape to the wings if you like. Make them bigger. Do that. Once in a while, I'll take the ends of the wings and I'll just kind of hold the wing with my thumb and finger and I'll make sure it doesn't close and I'll just pinch the tip. Same thing with that one. Same thing with that one. And same thing with that one. Okay. And so, straighten out that. That. And there you have it. A little dragonfly. And then, so, Daniel, I hope this helps you and, and the kids have a wonderful time at Waldorf. We hope you find great enjoyment from the dragonfly wire wrapper.